Have you ever wondered where you can find the largest street food market, indoor market in Europe and what it is like? Well, I certainly never have, but I've stumbled upon it and I'm pretty hungry after walking around this 35 degrees southern Spain heat. So I thought I'd just check it out and of course I'll bring the camera along. So um, I'll just walk in there now and keep rolling tape and see what we can find. Hopefully there's some food for us and I'll just switch the camera around for you. So this is the entrance and it's a beautiful modernist piece of architecture with thousand market stalls and the building itself is about 100 years old and is one of the main works of the Valencian Art Nouveau and apparently everything from um, food, meat, fish to alcohol and even souvenirs are sold in here and I've heard that vendors <laughs> can be a bit sketchy so I'll pay attention as always and um, yeah, let's walk in. I think I have to put my mask on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Wow. But the beautiful Hamon everywhere. Yeah, Hamon is the best. Wow, look at the ceiling. This is exactly what the architecture here, the Valencian Art Nouveau, is all about. It's these ceilings and these exact colors with a thousand stalls it's amazingly um, large in here and vast and so many people come here for daily shopping let's find something like back here yeah look i like a lot of bakers just a moment i need a moment a sausage. Yes, I want one of these, okay? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, some empanadas with tuna and tomatoes. Very nice. Let's check out the fish they have. Here's the fish area, it's divided. Oh my god. Okay, let's try this jamón. Mmm, a close-up of me having jamón. Jamón ibérico. Look at the jamón. Oh. While we weren't there, it was raining and we finished our small um, small lunch. We, we paid three euros for a little bit of cheese and a little bit of the Serrano Iberico, which was very nice. Um, but it's very hard to film in there since people are not really welcoming you when you're with the camera, especially uh, when I wanted to film the, the, the fish selection that they have with the shark and all that. <laughs> yeah, man, they were really pissed off. I don't even know if it's illegal to have a big shark like this one here, maybe. And that's also why they were skeptical of me with the camera. There's a tapas bar here, they're everywhere. We're gonna check out some tapas later then. 